Hey, how's it going everybody? I'm Larry and I live in Fort Worth, Texas and uh, I do reviews on fountain pens, paper, inks, notebooks, Crayola, just different stuff like that. No, I'm no expert. I've just been in the fountain world now for going on two years and I'm still learning but everybody has different opinions what they like and what they don't like and uh, I have my own and uh, I plan on uh, doing some reviews very soon. Uh, everybody has their own style, methods. I have my own. Uh, nothing fancy, no high-tech cameras, lights, nothing like that. It's just a uh, camcorder, me, and uh, doing what I like doing. My love for fountain pens, which I really love the fountain pens. And the ink that goes with it. I'm a blue ink kind of guy mostly myself, but there's some other colors. You know, I, I'm not into blank ink because I've used blank ink for so long a period of time at work, 10 years, and I just got burned out. That's the only ink that was allowed. So, anyway, I have found two or three very interesting black inks. I like my ink to be rich, bold, and make a statement when you write with it. Uh, same with my blues. My favorite blues in this world is the private reserve line. A lot of people don't like them. That's cool. I love them. I like the uh, Private Reserve Electric DC Blue and the uh, Super Show Blue, I believe it's called. And uh, there's another one that's slipped my mind. And I'm checking out a couple of their black inks. Oh, I think it's a velvet blue. Looks pretty cool. But uh, those are my favorites. In fact, uh, I've gone through my bottle of uh, ink. Almost gone, so I need to hurt and get some. But the problem is, Goulet Pins don't, doesn't carry the private reserve line anymore. And so I got with Anderson Pins and they're out of stock and uh, Lisa's been ordering it but it hadn't come in yet and this ink I have just found out uh, a family or people rather in India a small group make this ink by hand and they make the labels and they put it all together all by hand and then they ship it out well that's pretty good and they make it as simple as they can so they won't so you, the consumer, the customer, won't get charged an arm and a leg for it. But anyway, I thought I'd mention that, and uh, that's that for now. Well, I'm on my exercise bike right now, and I got my official monster shirt on. Halloween time, you know, love Halloween. So, peace, love, be safe, later.